rain in the area, but we've been given the go-ahead to get this one started. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Birmingham Barons and the Chattanooga Lookouts. We've got baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. So stepping in is Laz Rivera, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. And that one yanked just foul. Lays oh, off two and two out. now. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Crook is there, and he makes the catch for the out. Stepping in next, number 51. He readies for his first plate appearance. Line drive to center field. Hendrick is there, two gone. Digging in will be Samir Duenas. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. Left side, but well foul. Bases are empty here with two men out. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Ready now is Michael Ciani. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Here comes the one two. Opposite field to left. Booker has him played perfectly as he puts it away for round number one. Stepping up is Narciso second. Crook. The left fielder. Narciso. Crook. Just well, outside that time, laid off for a ball. Into the corner and slicing foul. Tried to get him with the cutter, but it's a full count, three and two. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a 3-2 change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible to hit. And he missed with that one. It's that ball hurt. four. A one-out walk here in the home first. One-one. Strike called. Now the throw down. Not in time as he steals second. take this one to the back for the out but meanwhile the runner will move up 90 feet to third base so now here is Juan Martinez looking to put them ahead early with this at bat ready with the 1-1 one -one. here's the pitch swung out and missed one and two now that's a really nice thing about pitching with the base open you can work out of the strike zone a little bit more and try to get a guy to chase your pitch just like that one. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Hit in the air to shallow center. Number 51 is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. New inning set to get underway, and now it'll be the catcher, Nate Nolan. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Still a ball and two strikes. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Now with the plate is Zach Remillard. 
exact. So no, one one home. High in the air out to center field. And two quick outs here in the second. At the plate now is Joel Booker. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Booker. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats out of play. It's 1 and 2. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. And now here is Wilson Garcia. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. The 1 1 home. And here's a slider. Strike three called, and that'll be the first out of the inning. Batting six. Next, it'll be Errol stop. Robinson. Errol. Still looking for our first Robinson. hit in the ball game. Swing and a hard liner to center field. Number 51 is there, and he has it for the out. So next that to is hit is Brantley the Bell. Dedicated hitter. Brantley Bell. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. And he fouls this one off. Slider on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. And now, Evan Scope, 7 8 9, bottom of the order set to go here in the third. The 1 1. That's a base hit, their first of the game. Batting it. The white fielder. Blake. Into the box. Blake Rutherford. Called strike two. Good eye to lay off the slider there, and he works it to full three and two here. The offense better get it going right here because they certainly can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. He'll try it again three and two. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already and there's your first out. The second base. Skog, base runner at first with one out. No contact there, and one it's ball. one and two. two yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball, you could tell he was out in front on that slider. I think he goes to the well two one ball. more time with that. The count now at two and two. As a look, now the pitch. And this is swung on and missed. His fifth strikeout already, and there are two gone in the inning. The bat, so the batting order turns Four over five. now and set to Lad. go. Laz Rivera, Rivera flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. <laughs> Fouled away. He's set and the 1 2 pitch. No, that's down. Just a bit low. Tough call, but it's 2 and 2. Count remains 2 and 2. Full count now. Three and two. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. And a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. Ball two as the breaking ball misses inside. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Oh, Three, and one. Three and one here. You have to make a good pitch on the mound. Grooving one here rarely works in your favor unless the hitter tries to do too much with it. Aye. Strike two called, and it's full. It Three pull. and two. Oh. 
towards second. And this is taken for the out. Bottom of the third now. And standing in is the switch hitting second baseman, Ivan Johnson. Bouncer up the middle. Scooped up. And a bit oh. of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. So it. next to bat will be Chucky Robinson. Robinson. And then this is two and two. I know he missed with a fastball right there, but this guy's arsenal. You can't figure out what he's trying to do. He's got a lot of different directions he could go in right here. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing, our score. Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll reach second now with one away. Now back, right fielder, Michael Ciani. In now, Michael Ciani fouled off. Runner at second here with one man out. He pops him up toward the left side of the infield. Rivera takes charge and he's got it. Two down. So the next to bat will be Narciso Crook. Runner in scoring position with Sugar. The payoff pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Rutherford is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. So now to the plate, Samir Duenas. He went down on strikes in his last at bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Lifted the other way to left center. Hendrick is right there, one down. Next will be the cleanup now hitter, batting. Nate Nolan. Struck out in his last trip to the plate. Just one hit apiece for both of these clubs. The ball in two strikes. Hey, I couldn't tell from up here if the hitter was taken all the way or sitting fastball and just got knee bumped. Either way, that was a really good curveball right there. Move on to the next pitch, but have that in the back of your mind. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. That was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on two and two, but when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's obviously easy to take that one. Next, here is now Zach Remillard. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Hey. Good pitch there. Catches the outside corner for strike two. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing it. That will have to press pause. Is that strike three to retire the side? So now into the box is Austin Hendrick. He set to lead us off in the home half of the fourth inning. The old adage, pitching and defense have been stellar so far. They've certainly kept both offenses in check. Hold hard, but it's foul down the first base side. Payoff pitch one more time. Oh, and he leaves the fastball up there. Mistake in location. He is going to pay for it dearly as that ball is sent over the wall. A home run. Standing in now, Juan Martinez. No yep, offer on that out. one. Two balls and a strike. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Three and one to him now. 
taken, and that one catches the bottom part of the strike zone. Hit hard on the ground towards second. He's right there. On to first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. The first Next to dig six. in, Wilson Garcia, Wilson. 0 for 1, went down looking Garcia. his first time up. Here comes the 1 2. Misses for Back the down. second Two ball. Faces are empty, one man out. Hit on the ground to short, reined in. And there are two away now. Stepping in once again is Errol Robinson. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, Matty, but as he walks to the plate right here, he feels good building off that last AB. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. set for the start of the inning and next to bat will be the outfielder Joel Booker and the pitch on two and one oh, that's hey, awesome. throwing the ball great up into this point don't want to allow a leadoff walk needs to just focus in on his mechanics right here hit out of play and it's a full count now the three two pitch He's taken, but called strike three as he might have gotten a little extra off the plate that time. Now that up next, Evan Scope he collected a base hit his first time up. The 1-1. One, one. Sent on the ground out to second. Fielded cleanly. And there's out number two. Next in at the plate is Blake Rutherford. Struck out in his first at bat. Yeah, kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. And this will stay inside the third base bag. A fair ball. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. The batter with the ball. Second base. Jose Rodriguez. At the plate now, Jose Rodriguez. The bouncer to the left side. Nothing will come with a two out double as the inning is over. Set now for the bottom of the fifth and striding forward the designated hitter, Brantley Bell. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Oh, textbook slider there, and he's back at even two and two. Really starting to pour now, and the forecast is not showing any signs of a break in the weather. You know, one of the big issues is player safety, and right now this field is getting sloppy wet, Matt, and I don't know how much more rain this field can take. Lifted the other way to left center. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there, and that's the second out. Next to him, now Chucky Robinson. He doubled his last time up. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Got him swinging, and that's the third out. Riding in is Laz Rivera. He's 0 for 1 thus far. From the windup, the 1-1 one, one pitch to short. Scooped up. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Next to stand in is number 51, 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. Now the 1-1 one and one pitch. And you know, the heavy stuff has finally arrived. This has got to be the hardest rain we've seen all afternoon. And there's a line drive. Base hit to left field. At the plate, Samir Duenas. And it's fouled away.
had to wait back on the changeup, and he did a good job just to make contact. When a pitcher puts you in the proverbial rocking chair like he's doing right now, you have to take a deep breath. You can't start trying to guess along with him. Trust your fundamentals and stay on that fastball. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Samir Duenez goes down for out number two in the top half. So one, two. Ball two. A runner on first with two away. And he fouls this one off. Hammered the other way to deep right field. Right fielder looking up, still ranging back. And that one is gone on a two-strike count with two away in the inning. Into the box now, Zach Remillard. That's a ball. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. Two balls, one strike. And the knees for a called strike, and it's back to even at two and two. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Swing and a liner. But he will close fast out there in right field as he comes on to put it away, and the inning is over. Zach Muckenhern enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 45. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And next will be the speed threat. Michael Ciani. The 1-1 home. It's a changeup that's looked at for a ball. Line drive base hit. Now that left field. Narciso. To the plate now, Narciso Crook. I got two it's a breaking down. ball, but it's laid off and doesn't find the zone. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. Now a throw over. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Now a foul tip right into the catcher's glove as he's able to hang on for the first down. The center fielder, number 12. Now at the plate, Austin, Austin Hendrick. He's one for two in this one. And that home run he hit his last time up, he isn't going to forget about anytime soon. He absolutely destroyed a fastball. I love the approach out on the mound. Everything's down in the zone as it should be, but now you find yourself in a 3-1 count. Do you elevate a little bit more and get back in this zone, or do you just pitch around it? And he'll stay with it to put it away the as they get their man eight. here for the second out. Siani is off the first with two away. Good breaking ball there, laid off for the second strike. Can't waste getting the leadoff runner on in this situation. Someone's got to bear down and get a big knock. Well below the knees, laid off on the changeup there. Fouled away. The 2 2 one more time. Right side. And there's his first base hit in this one. They'll hold it second, and there are two aboard now. The first base hit. In now, Wilson Garcia. Ground ball left side. And the inning will end as they're unable to cash in with two outs. Your Raybar San Martin is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 44. Seventh inning ready to roll. And digging in is the outfielder, Joel Booker. Two balls and a strike. A couple of strikeouts early in the game, but he's done a much better job in this at bat trying to get ahead and put himself at a good hitter's count. Little tardy on that swing as it's well wide at first. Here now the 2 2. 
gets him looking up around the letters. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Evan Scope. He bounced out last time up. Good idea with the change, but it's two and one. Two balls, one strike. Lifted the other way down the left field line. Crook is over now, and he puts this one away in foul territory, and there are two men out. So here is Blake Rutherford, one for two in the ball game thus far. We're in the seventh inning now, but pitchers duel two to one our score. Maybe too much break on the slider, two and one. To first, he's got it. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Tyler Johnson will take over on the mound to start the bottom of the seventh. Number 68. Now into the box, Errol Robinson. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. Great situation right here. Leading off the inning, you've got to find a way to get on base any way possible. But I don't like to take the aggression away from hitters. If it's in your zone, I want you swinging. Next, it'll be Brantley Bell. Been a strikeout victim twice in this one. The 1-1 one -one misses off the plate. Boy, not exactly what you'd like as a pitcher. One of the keys is to minimize your pitches, attack the strike zone early, a lot of deep counts, and working himself into a lot of trouble. Three and one to him now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Fastball is taken for a strike, and he runs it full three and two. And he missed with it. Ball four. So that means now the potential tying run will move into scoring position at second. Second baseman. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. Two and two. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And he has come through big time as this ought to tie the ball game and maybe even get him a lead. And the runner from second is in to score. It's now a 2-2 ball game. Vince Arobio comes on now, and he'll now take over with nobody the out catcher. in inning number seven. Jackie. Into the box, Chucky Robinson. Hit out towards second. Reined in. And the throw to first is in time. One gun. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Michael Ciani. We'll see if he can deliver here. Runner still at second and third with one away now. Here's the 3 1. We got three and two. Bailed him out with a swing. Three and two now. Well, this is a strikeout situation, but it's also a ground ball situation. I expect we'll see a lot of pitches down in the zone trying to prevent it. And he has broken this one open as this is down for extra bases. He pulls into second safely as two runs come across to score, and they grab the lead. Now back, the left fielder, Narciso. So now to the plate, Narciso Crook. And he comes back with a fastball, one and two now. That's a tough pitch for a batter. If you're not expecting it, you'll end up with half a bat after you swing. Just hung in there on that one. Three runs already home here. Oh, tough pitch cool. to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. And that misses there, so he runs to count full now. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. And the lead will move to three as it's now a 5-2 to two game. Stepping in now, 
Austin Hendrick. Taken, but called for strike two on the outer part of the zone. Ah, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. So now here's the cleanup it. hitter, Juan Martinez. He's working on a one for three thus far. That's High and wide, two balls and a strike. He's falling behind now, three and one. That's a close pitch right there, but I think he's just nibbling a little bit too much. Out of the pen sometimes, you just have to come in and go right after guys. Hit on the ground out to short. He's right there, and he'll go the short way to retire the side. Nick Howard has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Look out. Number 34. Now at the plate, here is Jose Rodriguez. It's been an 0-for-2 effort for him to this point. The 3-2 pitch. Fly ball out toward left center field. Crook will range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first out. And stepping in, Laz Rivera. He's 0-for-2 thus far in this one. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's 2-1 and one now. Got to find a way to scratch at least one across. You do not want to take on the monster closing the game down three. And boy, just about overshot his man at first, but he's able to keep a foot on the bag over there, and that's out number two. Next up, number 51, singled in his last at-bat. The three-and-one pitch. He's in there for a full count now, three and two. Yeah, this is one of my biggest pet peeves in the game. When guys get count leverage and take fastballs, it's a game of fastballs. You calibrate everything off the heater. Surprising take right there. Popped him up. Garcia has got it, and the side is retired. Bennett Souza is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 86. Bennett. Wilson Garcia will be the first one to greet him as he'll have to turn around and bat from the right side of the plate here. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Skied into straightaway right. Right fielder is on the run, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. Next up is Errol Robinson. Errol Robinson. Set to deal. Here's the 3 1. Nope, too high, there. and that cost him ball four. Next will be the designated hitter, Brantley the Bell. No hitter. hits to this point. Brantley. Bell. Here it comes on one and one. Nope. And the pitch misses low and away for ball two. Inside for a ball as he falls behind to him here, three and one. in there and it'll run the count to full three and two count three and two I think it's a real possibility that they put that run on first in motion that would help them stay out of that double play that would end the inning but that's also kind of risky at the same time one there on to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning Ryan Richardson takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Number 24. 
Oh, yeah. All set to start the ninth in this one. And next to bat will be the first baseman, Samir Duenez. They look like they're up against it here. Down three on the road, trying to come back against the closer. Breaking ball snaps in there for a bold strike two. Sharp ground ball to third. Fielded cleanly. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Nate Nolan. And he's coming off a two-run homer his last time around. That last A.B. when he hit the home run, that was a decent changeup. It was down in the zone, but one of the problems when you have a good changeup like this pitcher does, hitters go up there and they kind of look for that changeup. So he's going to have to locate it a little bit better in this upcoming at-bat. Zach Remillard will be next. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. Throw on to first, and the ball game is over. Hey, this was a pretty tightly played game. Got a little bit of everything in this one. Some timely hitting, runs on the board, key pitching, and defense in certain spots. This one was a fun one to watch. Five to two, the final today. The Chattanooga Lookouts put up four runs in the seventh to carry them to victory. Raybar San Martin earns the victory on the mound. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Mark DeRosa and Dan Fleezak and the rest of the crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. Find out more, head over to theshow.com. The final line score for our ball game for the victorious lookout five runs seven hits no errors they left six men on base for the Barons.